Today I'd like to demonstrate doing a backstitch bind off in the round. It leaves a really nice invisible and stretchy bind off. So I have 10 rows of garter right here and I've ended, uh, the last row I did was a pearl row. And so now I've cut off about three times the circumference of the work. And that's what I'm going to sew with. And I'm going to start my back stitch bind off by going in the next stitch and then back to the previous stitch. And it's very much like doing a back stitch in uh, sewing or embroidery. So from here, I'm going to go to skip over this stitch and go to this stitch and then back one same thing I'm going to skip that stitch I just sewed and go to the next one and back one and just continue on like that you're here right now, you're in this stitch, skip this stitch and go into the next one, to the one that you have not sewn at all, and then just back up one. And I'm not pulling very tight at all. I'm just trying to maintain a really even tension. And notice how I don't go in and then pull it all the way. That way I can have my needle come out above the strand of yarn. So it's always above and I'm not splitting anything. Skip. Go back one. So each each stitch is going to be sewn twice. And what you get is a lot of looping around, which gives you a lot of length that makes it very stretchy. Now I'm here and I'm going to skip the next stitch. I'm going to go to the next to the following stitch which happens to be on the other needle. Down that, and then back up the previous stitch, which is on this needle. And now I can continue on. One small tip is as you're sewing along, sometimes your yarn will get twisted or untwisted. Just let it relax and then you'll be able to carry on like normal. I'm at the end of my work. I'm in the same spot where I was in the beginning. I'm at this stitch. So I'm just going to go back and do the last, I mean, the, the first couple stitches one more time. Just going to overlap those stitches. And I like to come out in the very middle of the work. So I've completed the circle. I can take my needles out. And just with a little tug. And there you have it. Really nice stretchy like you can't feel any tension along the edge there and it notice how it retracts it doesn't flare out like some uh, bind offs do and now it's just a matter of weaving in the ends and cutting off any loose strands so this was just a small short glove 
done in a very lightweight acrylic. All of my edges were done in the same way with the back stitch bind off. And it allows for a nice ease of movement and a really nice edge.